Hi all, Karen Dahl here again, more Calico Critters. This is the Toy Poodle family. I have not seen this family before, so I don't know if it's a new family or not. I have to go on the website and kind of look and see, because I know they do come up, usually come up with a couple new families every year. So um, I saw these guys, I was at a Toys R Us, I don't stop at all the time when I got these guys, and it was a couple weeks ago, they were buy one, get one 40% off, so I got the Tuxedo Cat family, which was just in my last video, so check that one out, and picked up this one, because I thought they were cute. So if you're not familiar with Calico, Calico Critters, they're a collection of different animal families. They live in, I forgot, Calico Village. Don't ask me why I do it, <laughs> totally blank on that. These guys are beautifully detailed. I absolutely love these. They're a little pricey, but well worth the price. And I was looking on the bottom, like I said, I think they're with Epoch Company LTD and International Playthings. Um, overseas, like over in Europe, they're called Sylvain, Sylvian or Sylvain, Sylvain families. So um, I've kind of read about this before on the back about them living in Calico Village. You can follow them on Facebook, calicocritters.com. Um, on size it says about removable clothing and beautifully detailed so let me go ahead and get our toy pool oh I forgot to look at the bottom on the bottom of every box it kind of gives details about the family so the mother is Veronica is a fantastic baker she makes the most delicious cakes and is always thinking of new recipes she likes to invite critters to her home to taste her newest creations excuse me Father is Frank, is very athletic and enjoys playing sports. He teaches soccer to all the children in Calico Village on the weekends. He is also always well dressed and even has a large collection of ties to match any outfit. Sister is Melinda, can be shy at times. She likes learning how to bake and decorate cakes from her mother. She also likes to have fun tea parties at her home and invite all her friends from school. And brother is Eric, is very smart and at the top of his class. He also likes to help other students at school if they're having problems understanding a certain subject. He studied hard to make sure he always gets straight A's. Does that sound like anybody out in my viewer land out there? Getting straight A's and studying? Bob would say that's Karen Dahl when she was in school. And this one didn't come with a checklist. So now I'm even more curious because I wanted to see if maybe they had some newer things or newer items out and everything. And I was going to talk about like some of the play sets that we currently have and everything. Like I said, um, we've been collecting Calico Critters, I'd say about two years now. Um, absolutely love them. I, we have more, I have, we have so many more families. Like I said, I know I did a Chocolate Lab family review. I can't remember if I did the Hedgehog. The Pickleweed Hedgehog family, I think is what they're called. Um, that was one Bob didn't really want to get, but I love them. They have like the wild hair. I think I reviewed their kids. That's why I'm thinking about that. But I've done other Calico reviews, so go and check them out. Calico Critters. Love them, love them, love them, love them. Can't say enough. Okay, well, Mom's kind of falling over, and I have her in my hand. So this is Mom, Veronica. So um, they all have the beady, beady eyes. That sounded real nice. The beaded eyes. But like I said, the detail is amazing. Like on their ear, and I don't know if this will pick up on camera. Um, if you know what a poodle looks like, it kind of has like the poodle type texture over here with like the waviness and all that. And these guys feel like a velvet. They are soft. They are, they are amazing. I can't say enough about them. But um, she has this real pretty yellow dress on with some pink flowers. We got a little bit of pink trim up here by her collar with a little flower. And then pink trim along the bottom. And she has a little bushy, bushy tail in the back. And then here's the Velcro if you would want to remove their, change her outfits or anything. Um, I, as you saw in previous videos for the articulation, their head, shoulders, and her hips are stiff. 
so you know you can put them in the seated position and sometimes just coming out of the box are a little stiff like i said these are very 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 high quality that's why i love them and then what was sister's name melinda so she kind of just looked like a smaller version of mom like i said the kids are a little bit smaller than the parents she has a real pretty kind of a pink dress on with some pink trim and she has different color flowers in it pink bow lace around her collar and her shoulders whoops and her tail's kind of caught in the back of her dress so i'm gonna get her try to pull her tail out so you guys can see it and then i'm gonna try to fix her dress i always love when the, it doesn't want to cooperate so her tail's not sticking out real good but it's kind of smaller than what mom's is okay it, her dress doesn't want to close so i'm gonna go ahead and just stick her tail in it she's giving me some grief okay the articulation is that her head's really stiff head shoulder and hips with all of them and then dad frank he's kind of they said he's a snazzy dresser he looks pretty snazzy to me so he has this really cute like dress shirt on and it's kind of in like i don't know if that's a pink or a peach i think it's more of a peach because hers is more of a pink and that's kind of yellow and some brown and white she, he has a green tie white collar with some green trim and his nice green pants on and then here's his tail and there's where velcro's in the back um his pants his pants are separate so they would come off separately so that's dad frank and then brother is eric so he's wearing um a little yellow top white collar a little green button then he has little suspenders i don't know if you guys i'll try to pull them down a little bit so he has little suspenders on from his pants so his pants are kind of kind of like the same design as dad's except they're green with the yellow the brown and the white and then here's his back and his pants his pant bottoms are separate you would just have to take off the suspenders with that so like i said this is the toy poodle family calico critters like i said i can't recommend them enough um i usually get mine at toys or us i know they are available some other places but that's usually where i end up getting mine um, especially when they're having the sales. The sales are great. Anyways, please remember to like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell icon so you know when I post new content. Also, stay tuned for more giveaways. Just recently wrapped up my mini one, and then once I get to 500, I'm going to do another one. So help me out. Share my page. Invite your friends. Invite your family. You know we have fun over here at Karen Doll. Um, I think I said follow me on Facebook or Twitter, but I'm going to remind you again. I think that's it. I'll see you guys in the next one. Let me know if there's something you want me to review. Bye.